Hey, uh, Dtom317 here, and I'm going to touch on an issue today that's near and dear to my heart. That issue is panic buying. I mean, I can't find ammo for this gun, a G17, but I can find ammo for this gun, which is a G23. Granted, it's still pretty scarce. It's not going to be banned. I mean, and you know, can't you reload? The way to, the, the way politics are in this country suggests that Democrats and the rural states are not going to touch guns, not going to touch ammo. Sure, you might be in a certain jurisdiction that limits the amounts you can have or limits the uh, magazine capacity, but to be honest, I mean, 9mm and 40SW are going nowhere. Not to mention the fact that law enforcement uses 40N, uh, 40SW and 9mm. Panic buyers, I want to reach out to you and say, you're the reason stores have to ration the two to three boxes a person or less. You know, the stores aren't doing that because of a certain law. The stores are doing that because they want me to be able to get the ammo that you otherwise would buy up. And I've seen you, you can go in with your whole family, but still the stores know. And that's why they have, they have it so, so. I don't mind people having a lot of ammo. You just need to be considerate of new shooters right now. I bought a gun not because of fear of bands, but because I figured, well, why not? You know, I need a gun for self-defense, home defense anyways. You know, it's just, you know, people like me, we need, as I said earlier, we need practice. We need to be able to go out on a range and get proficient because otherwise, we're going to be in a self-defense situation. We're going to be in our homes sometime at night, and you don't know. We might wildly fire because we're we're scared, and that's gonna not going to be a good thing in the long run. You know, I might injure I might injure somebody. I might negligently shoot somebody. I'm not hoping. I, I don't want to do that, and I'm not hoping for it. But it's a distinct possibility if I don't have enough range time, and that's why I'm purposely not getting my permit until I have so many rounds through my Glock. It's just that I want to get comfortable with the gun, and I want to know that I can hit what I'm shooting at. And what I'm shooting at, I hope will be the bad guy, or the shooter in a mall. Another thing, panic buyers, nobody can find 22 LR. That's what parents teach their kids to shoot on. That's what the guy who takes his girlfriend to the range has her shoot. 22 LR. Why? Because it's low recoil, because it's cheap, because it's fun. And if I can't find that, I mean, it just astounds me. You know, I can sort of understand, I can sort of get a feel for why you're buying handgun ammo, why you're buying, you know, like, centerfire rifle ammo, but 22 lr People shoot squirrels with that, come on. And it's just a fun plinking round. It's like, it's, I don't want to call it a kid caliber, but kids learn on it. I learned on 22. You, who are watching this video, who are a panic buyer, probably learned on 22. And another thing, um, uh, and this is going to be tough, I'm going to, I'm going to attack the government on this one, um, uh, Department of Homeland Security, you need a few billion rounds of 40 jack of the hollow point for what exactly? I mean, I'm trying to think, you know, you're not going to be using jack of the hollow point at the range. You know, I can understand security, but billions of rounds? Yeah, that's a little fishy. Well, uh, thanks for watching my video on panic buying. Uh, feel free to comment, subscribe, ask us any questions you have. Uh, this is Tom 317 signing out.